Welcome to my video. This video is an unboxing video for M beads. They kindly allowed me to choose some items and I'd like to use and they've sent them to me. Um, I have received them. I have unpacked them because they're in a plastic bag and then inside the plastic bag that everything's wrapped in bubble wrap and there was that much sellotape around it, I knew I would struggle. Um, to open it up on camera um so i will say they're very well packed when they arrive um i have opened up all the little bags as well because i struggle to open the um ziploc bags um so let's see what i chose so the first item i chose is you'll all recognize the box it is a wax seal stamp i don't know if you can see that or whether that's glaring i hope it's not glaring it's actually santa's face um and that was two pound 97 all the prices are in great british pounds um i've gone through my order online and wrote all the english prices all the british pounds sterling price stamps on the paper on my list so that i've so that we know how much they cost here in the uk so that's the santa wax seal stamp um the next item that i got were these pastel bead mix now these are eight mil um and there is approximately a hundred in the bag um, and they're all lovely little colours. If I just show you the bag there as well. Um, so you've got lovely pastel colours there. And they're all pearlised. And they are 77 pence for the bag of 100. Um, oops, I'm throwing them all over the table now. I also got the 4mm beads in the same mix. Um, so if you can see that. So they're the same, but all the same colours so that I can work with both together. Um, I can get these ones back in there. Without losing half of them. And they are... Let me find them on my list. They're £1.12 and there's approximately... 400 in that little bag there so that's not bad for one pound 12. the next item are these tibetan tibetan style alloy stamping blank tag charm pendants um i'm not quite sure what you would stamp on those i presume they mean the metal stamping but they're very small you wouldn't be able to stamp much on there. I just wanted to use them in with my Christmas crafting. Um, and there is a hundred in there. And they were £1.80. And they're approximately 10 mil by 8 mil. So the 10 mil would be from the bottom of the star to the top of the hole there. Um... So that those those ones. Then I have these alloy enamel kitten charms. These are in pink. These are quite sweet. Um, I really like those ones. Um, and they are there's ten in the packet, and they are one pound twenty five. Um, and they're gold in colour on the back. And they are 12.5 mil. I also have... Some white heart charms. The same look. They're the same with the gold on the back. Um, I've gone for mainly pastel colours this time. So let me tell you how much they are. Oh, there they are. They were 97 pence for the 
for the 10. So let me just put that there. Um, I've also gone for some alloy charms and these are candy canes. Um, little Diddy ones look. And again, there's a hundred in the pack and they are £1.53 for the hundred. So you get quite a few look if you look at the pack there there's there's quite a lot i then have these glass ball pendants with the they're like seed beads or micro beads inside um but they are glass they're quite large. Excuse the, the felt tip on my hands. I've been colouring. Um, and they are 21 mil. And you get 20 in the pack. And they were um, £2.12. pence. So they're quite nice. I'll just be careful putting those back because I don't want to smash them because they are glass. Um, and then got... As you can see, I've gone for mainly charms this time. These Parve, I presume that's how you pronounce it, Parve Disco Ball Beads. Um, they're made by polymer clay with rhinestone beads. Um, and they are 10 mil with a 1.5 mil hole. And um, there's 10 in the pack um, and they were 95 pence for the 10 so they're really pretty really sparkly those ones are with the rhinestone beads and then went for these plum coloured round charms um, can you see those there are 10 in the pack and they were £1.22 and they are they are eleven mil, and they're flat. They're not. They're a flat bead or charm. It's a nice colour. Those ones are. Um, and then went for these black. What do they call it? These are natural black agate bead strands, and they're frosted. They are six mil with a one mil hole, and there's approximately 65 pieces on the, on the strand, and they were two pounds six. I really like those. They're like a matte color, so they're nice. They're not shiny at all. I to think of something to do with those. I then went, just checking for these butterfly charms. And they're the same as the cat ones and the heart ones. They've got the gold color and they're just enameled, pink enamel. Um, and there are 10 in the pack. And again, they were one pound 22. And there's 10, they're 10.5 mil um, with a two mil hole, oh, 1.2 mil hole. Um, so that's those ones. I then went for these glass bead strands. If you can see those, I got two packets of those, um, and they're Bicone beads, light blue with the AB coating on them. Um, and they're about six mil in diameter, it says, um, with a hole of about one mil. There's 46 um, beads on a strand and they were 55 pence each. Um, and I bought two strands. A lot of it is, is very pastel -y. I'm losing these all over my table. 
I then went for these really small jump rings. These are... I don't know if you can see those. Oh, too many. There we go. I don't know if you can see them really small ones. And I've got them all over my table. But I'll pick them up in a minute. Just push them out of the way. And they are four mil. Uh, and there's 50 gram in there. And it says there's approximately 300 beads in there. And they were 40, 49 pence. Um, I've gone for some more jump rings. Um, we'll do this pack first. So I've gone for them in the silver and the gold. Um, the gold ones are... The 18 gauge, they're 7 mil um, with the inner diameter of 5 mil. I'm not going to open them up because I will have them all over my table. Um, and they were 54, 56 pence for 10 grams. Um, and they're 18 gauge, those ones. And then we have these ones, which are the iron colour. Um, and they are or stainless steel colour, they're saying, 20 gauge, um, and they're 7 mil, uh, with an inner diameter of 5.4 mil. Um, and again, there's 10 gram, and there's 120 pieces approximately, and they were 49 pence. So I've got them in gold and in the stainless steel. I then went for some iron coloured wire uh, chain, not wire, if I can get it out, it's quite a small link, I've got quite a few that are long links, but this is bigger links, but this is quite a small link, if you can see that, let me get a piece of paper, Let's see if you can see it better on there, no, I don't think you can, it's a very small chain, chain link, um, but that's ideal for what I wanted it for. I didn't want a big bulky one. And that, there's two, meet, two meters in that. And that is 67 pence for that. Um, and there's two meters in there. I then had some stain, 304 stainless steel eye pins in the golden colour. Um, there is 20 in this bag um, and they are 40 mil, uh, but they are proper stainless steel, steel 304 stainless steel. Um, they're 40 mil, which is, you know, it's not massively over long, but it's big enough to make um, a glue stopper. Um, and they are one pound 10 for 20 pieces. I hope everyone's all right and is staying safe. It's a bit colder again today, isn't it? I then went for these spacer beads. I didn't expect these to be as small as what they are. So some of them are just more like a micro bead. I hope that's not glaring, but they look like they're open and I don't particularly want to take them out of the packet to have them all rolling around my table. Um, they are £1.97 um, for those. It just says one box. So you've got some bigger ones up here, um, but some of them are quite small, but they'd be ideal with the smaller four mil beads um, just to make the gaps. So there's mixed colours in those and they are one ninety seven. I then had some, this is 20 gauge. This is aluminium craft wire, beading wire. Um, let me see if I can open this. And this is 20 gauge. Um, it's approximately 0.8 mil. 
and there's 10 meters on the roll um find the end so that's it's quite thin um but it seems nice and thick nice a nice decent so that bends quite easy for jewelry beading um and that was 61 pence and there's about 10 meters on that um so that's going to come in handy i then ordered um some earring backs um i'd watched susan tootsie talkies video where she was making stick pins and i usually use the crimp beads but susan puts on the rubber earring backs you can't really see it in that so i ordered um some some of these in case I wanted to make some more stick pins. Um, I bought two packets of those. And they are... There's 200 pieces in a bag. Um, it weighs 5 gram. And they are 25 pence a bag. So for 50 pence, there's 400 of those. So that's a really good price. For those and if i was making your earrings you could use those as backs as well um just make these jump rings that i've got all over the place and then the last thing i bought or ordered was some bead storage boxes now i was amazed at the price of these I bought five of these simply because of how reasonable well, the price was on these. So I bought five. I'm not going to unwrap them. All, they're all exactly the same. And these were, that one's got the label on, I think. It just says one set on there. These have got ten holes. They're not very big. They're what your beads would come in if you were to order um, off Amazon. You know, I've got these in all different sizes where beads have come in them or um, jump rings, etc. All tend to come in this style of box. Um, and they are... Because I bought five of them, they're, they're 36 pence each. Um, if I was to buy them singly, they're 37 pence. Will you pay a couple of quid for a box like this on Amazon? Um, with an empty box, that is. So to get them for 37 pence or 36 pence, it's just amazing. So I bought five of those. Um, and that is my lot. That's everything that I ordered from Embeads. Um... <coughs> I would like to say a huge thank you to MBs for allowing me um, to choose all the lovely items that I've chosen. Um, I, there is a discount code. Um, I will leave that in the description below, along with all the other all the items that I chose, um, so that if you wanted to order them yourself, you could do. I will also come back on um, and do two videos showing you um what i use what i make with the products that i've ordered or how i use them um so for now i'd like to say a huge thank you to mbeads um for allowing me to choose all these wonderful items i'd like to say thank you for watching my video um and i'll be back on in a few days with my first video so all that's left for me to say, stay safe, everyone. Keep warm because it's getting really cold out there. Well, it is here. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.